Alright guys, I thought I'd do a quick foresight chat today. I apologize for the kids playing in the, with the motorcycles out in the background. It's been a while since we talked, I don't know, a month or two anyway. Um, yeah, it's, yeah. <clears throat> um, I, I, I'm, yeah, I don't know exactly how to say it. I'm not doing that well. Um, I'm, I'm back to work a little bit more than normal, which is good. But, you know, I haven't done any shows and I haven't uh, been making my typical products. I've been making a lot of videos. I kind of found myself this year because of a lot of other things that are going on. Uh, lucky enough to pick up some larger projects like the uh, like the a railing project and the and now this this tree rail that I'm working on now and a few other ones. So yeah, I think because you know I see it online. <clears throat> I haven't been that active online either. I'm just yeah. I get, well, I don't want to get into it, but. I get up and I get my ass to work as early as I freaking can, which is not early sometimes. And and then I work till I just, and then I go home. And I don't do a whole lot once I do that. Um, and that's that's okay, at least I'm showing up to work and it's a, it's a change. Now I don't want to get into that stuff. You can check out my other channel. We all have a story to follow. Damn, these guys got to be riding those noisy bikes. Uh, we all have a story is another channel I have where I talk more about the crap that's in my head. But, Anyway, the railing project, the tree railing project, is getting really close, which I'm excited about that. I mean, it's, it's got all, the first two trees have all of its main structure done. The, the big tree at the end, I still have a little bit to work to do, and I've already started the bench. So, um, yeah, I'm quite pleased with, great right now. <laughs> anyway, the tree railing project is, is uh, hopefully entering some of its final stages, and, you know, I know that I haven't been doing a lot of videos, but I've, I've put out some <clears throat> some updates. But I think there's a story behind this project that uh, you know. Obviously, I haven't been doing a lot of videos, which means I haven't making a lot of YouTube money, and that teaches me a lot. Uh, but in the end, you know, here's Chandler. I don't know when did I start this? Three years, three and a half years ago, um, and I went full time two and a half years ago. No, just two years. Two years. Shit. And then immediately after that, you know, my entire world outside of, you know, gets, you know, pulled up from underneath me. So here, back to this project. Man, you can tell my brain's a little fried today. Um, with just a little bit of experience, a heck of a lot of work, and, and in this case, me swallowing a lot of potential income. Um, you know, this project that I'm delivering is. Ten times the value that that uh, that I quoted for it, and I, I knew that I would go overboard with this one. It's like the pig project, and uh, but like what I'd like to say is, you know, how do you know if I, if you can make a, a thirty thousand dollar railing until you've actually made one? You know, so so now I do. How do you know if you can make a thirty dimensional sculpture and have any sense of you know, personality and and be able to pull that off um, like the pig? Now I do. So that, it was part of it. Um, but financially, no, we're in deep, 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 deep trouble right now. But once this is done, hopefully we'll get back into things. Um, my objective, once this project's done, is to uh, kind of sit down and rewrite the, the uh, business model. The business model, if you don't know, is when somebody's starting a business, you know, what is our purpose? What's our model? What's our, what's our most important thing? Customers come first, or, you know, what, that kind of thing. And uh, business model, and then you know that's usually some summarization of a business plan. And I've, you know, I've one of the things that you've noticed probably from me is that I don't specialize in any one thing. I've been all over the place trying to learn as much as I can through all sorts of things in a bunch of different directions. And um, I'm going to review that. I'm going to review the the content portion of my purpose here. Uh, I'm going to review the, the shows, the, the types of products, you know, the, do I keep going for the larger products? If so, I may not have room to do that in the shop, you know. So anyway, I'm, that's where I'm going to be very soon. I've, t I've taken your advice and um, I did, I've, I've, st I've created a patron account. I haven't gone active with that yet because that will be when I get back where I need to be and I'm producing content or I'm going to make a promise. One day a week we're going to do a weapon, uh, you know, and you know something like that. Once I know what that promise is, then I'll open that page up. Um, in the meantime, if you want to um, thank me for some of the content that, that I've already produced and uh, and taking you along through the journey now, um, I have 
broken into the um, the donate. There's a there's a donate button on my on my channel now. It's through PayPal, um, and I'll I'll sneak in a screenshot hopefully right here, um, and then you you, you, know, you can go back to my channel. Uh, I can. It seems greedy. The last couple videos I put a link in the in the description. I may continue to do that, but uh, either in the description link or um, back at the uh, my channel page on Chandler Dickinson for the old school Ford stuff. There is right there in the main picture on the right hand side. Probably that's your right hand. I don't know. Um, there is a support old school forge, a donate to old school forge, and and I feel like a bit of a loser doing that. But I provided some good content, and I intend to do so in the future. Um, and right now I'm, yeah, like right now I think struggling to keep get by is preventing me from creating. That the fun content, you know, let's go grab this and make something out of it. Um, so maybe, maybe it's right, maybe it's wrong. Once I get my my business model and plan back into where I think it's going to be, um, I'll have more regular content, and then I'll I'll go ahead and open the Patreon account because then I'll know you you're, you're going to get your money's worth in the future because you're pledging for a monthly thing. And anyways, so feel free. <laughs> Real free to send some hand and some money. Uh, some of you guys have already found that, and quite frankly, I just bought a settling today for this tree project, and I just bought some steel, and I used that money to do that, and it's keeping me it's keeping me in the business alive. Um, I, I guess this is longer than a normal or, or a short chat. One of the things that that I'm wrestling with because I'm trying to, I guess I'm setting an example with somebody that didn't know what they're doing, barely knows what they're doing, and you know, here I am, two years, just just. To, you know, two years and a month since I uh, left the professional engineering world. There's, you know, software engineering, industrial engineering, that kind of stuff. Uh, and I'm still here, and that's being broken almost instantly after I did that. So if I if I wasn't if I wasn't thrown into this place, uh, I I know. We were because when Melissa and I were together, we were doing. I mean, she was on the ball. She had the emails answered. She was taking orders. I was making stuff. We we're doing shows. We had online stuff going. Um, that team of effort. I won't say personalities or actual desires. You know, to to excel. That that was the piece that I needed. I knew I had her. I thought I had it, and that's what allowed me to 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 start the business. Well, that disappeared almost instantly, and I just I just can't get over it. For, for even the personal side of it is is barely even close to just man to do that to somebody just freaky, because I could have pulled it off and just continued to grow. And I think I'd be in a totally different place right now uh, as far as um, success in this process. Point is, I'm doing a lot of rambling. I see it all the time. Can you make a living doing blacksmithing? The answer is yeah. I actually think you can. You can make a decent living doing it, and it's not that hard. You know, I mean, not that the work isn't hard. It's a shitload of work. But if you if you have support, if you have that that extra person behind you to take care of the emails and the orders and things like that, and to keep you focused in the right direction and to get stuff scheduled. Uh, if you have somebody that is there to support you do that, the answer is absolutely. Um, I think you can today, as blacksmithing becomes more and more popular, it's kind of funny to say that, but I think it, this kind of stuff obviously is. Um, that may not be the case, um, but you, you need to be willing, I think, and I think it's true. I, I think even though it hurt me tremendously financially, the pig project and now this, this tree railing project, um, you need to be willing to Make sure push yourself beyond the expectations of the customer and beyond the expectations of their budget so that you you know you can pick up some of those higher you know every time you climb a ladder you're gonna get you're gonna get another rung to, to go to so you got to make those sacrifices can you make a living at it the answer I think is yes because I'm almost doing it you know I'm ba YouTube is basically nothing anymore um, and I'm almost doing it um, but I've gotten into a really tight spot recently, and I, you know, quite honestly, this could be the end of anything outside of the shop that I that I own and possess. And, um, but that's okay um, because I know 
the, yeah, you can do it, and I'm going to prove it to you. That, maybe that's it. I'm going to prove it to you. So anyways, um, we're, I'm finishing up the free project, and then we're going to refocus some things. Definitely content. I kind of missed you guys. It's like, Jesus, all I do are things that I got to do in order to try to get that freaking bill paid for next week. And, I mean, that's called life, but at the same time, it was easier to pay that bill next week when I was doing some of the things that I enjoy doing with you. So, very confusing times. Anyway, thank you all for your support. Thank you for all your comments. Uh, you're, you know, you guys are all standing behind me on both channels. Um, and, um, you know, if something in one of my previous videos, and hopefully some of the videos I'm giving you, uh, or even on the other channel, um, you know, if, there, if there's value in that to you, and uh, you want to help me continue to produce content, uh, I think that's probably the biggest thing. I, I'm trying to get back to producing content, and in order to do that, I need to have some some safety. So uh, feel free to go back to my channel page or click on the link below and um, shoot me off a buck or two or whatever it is you think is appropriate. And, and uh, I'm begging for money, but I'm begging to get back into the, the content. I think that's what I'm going to say, man. Anyway, we're still here. It's been two years and a month of, of very... You know, this, the cards were stacked against me because I was inexperienced. Cards were stacked against me because my entire support unit disappeared instantly as I started. Um, it's, I, I think I'm going to do it. I just got to get through. I might not have a home. <laughs> I might be sleeping in a tent. But outside of that, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get through it. I really am. And, uh, and I'm going to show you that you can, you can do it at different levels. I hope that's the plan. I got to rework, rework, rework my mind. Seriously, guys. If you are, you know, if any of you guys are stalking me on my Facebook channel, the um, my personal channel, um, you know, you see, you see people that are blacksmith related or YouTube related uh, making the supporting comments. Very few of the people that I know personally are 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 actually making comments and, and things. Some very very important people are, and you guys. So thank you, and uh, stick with it. So stick by me, stand by me. It's gonna happen. All right. Take care. Catch you on the next one, which I have no idea what it's going to be. It's going to uh, definitely the end of this tree video. I think it's going to turn out pretty cool. Thanks a lot, guys. Bye. Forgot to add is that if you haven't picked up your old school forge, it ain't too snappy T-shirt. Those still are available in, at uh, Teespring. I'll leave a link down below too. So I guess I'm trying anything right now. Ciao.